Jem, hit him with the hottest comic book in the world. All right, let's not talk about how is Miles Morales still number one on this list, but why. Before we jump into it, though, make sure you're subscribed to this channel because we do this list every single week. And jump over to my channel as well if you want to see statue reviews, omnibus, and weekly comic book reviews. As far as staying number one on this list, Miles Morales faced his toughest challenge yet, DC Fandom. DC Fandom did its thing last weekend, and with all those reveals and everything they showed us, this book, Ultimate Fallout 4, the 1 out of 25 Jejevic variant, still continues to outperform. And let's talk about why. Jim, it didn't even shake him this week. We got to go over these numbers, man, because you know it's going to be the new stand or variant of this issue. And this week, for good reason, it's replacing that new stand. Yeah, so put it like this. On Saturday, we saw a 9.8 sell for $8,400. So that's a strong sale, close to the all-time record of 9000 We also had some lower-grade sales with astronomical numbers. A 9.2 sold for $2,136. A 9.0 sold for $2,000. And a raw sale at $2,000. $878.36. Somebody is gambling big money to try to get a 9.8 out of that raw book. You could get this book for under $500 raw at one point in this year. Comic fam, you gotta be following us because you know we're gonna be keeping track of all of this stuff. Shout out Analysis X. Shout out Key Collector Comics for keeping the community all informed. And thank you for joining us as always. Stay minty fresh and geek responsibly.